hi yet another important video from network analysis and uh, two port network connected with the two port network all about deriving the expression for a b c d parameters also known as transmission parameters in terms of uh, z parameters and y parameters in my previous video i have i have done this derivation so i am making use of uh, those same derivations over here all right so that two important equations governing the abcd parameters what are those input is expressed in terms of output parameters input parameters v1 and i1 are expressed in terms of output parameters and they, those ratios and all finding out if what it is v1 is expressed in terms of uh, v2 and it's not the usual direction we consider in the two port network but the reverse direction for i2 it's transmitting the current is moving from inside to outside i2 we are not considering i2 towards the two port but it's away from the two port so we have negative i2 and again uh, i1 also expressing in terms of v also in terms of uh, v2 and negative i2 again we are considering the reverse direction transmission it's the input is i1 is the same direction but i2 against the direction which we consider from the beginning of the two port network all right so a over here plus b c plus d all right so uh, these are the two important governing equations for a a b c d parameters also known as transmission parameters so on the other hand we have a uh, expression for z parameters z parameters uh, we need to consider that one z parameters we have a uh, first equation being v1 equal to z11 i1 plus z12 i2 and the second equation v2 equal to z21 i1 plus z22 i2 on the other hand y parameters we have a uh, i1 equal to y11 v1 plus y12 v2 all right and the second equation being i2 equal to y21 v1 plus y22 v2 all right so uh, this in terms of these two parameters a b c d parameters in terms of uh, z parameters and when output is made zero i mean uh, when output is open i2 is made zero so in that case uh, with i2 equal to zero what do we have from the i2 equal to making i2 equal to zero what do we have from the two equations from the first equation we have v1 equal to a times v2 this will be zero and from this one what is a a will be equal to v1 by v2 with what condition i2 equal to 0 i2 equal to 0 so when i2 equal to z when i2 is made equal to 0 from here not over here right it's from here uh, when this this condition is applied over these two equations what do we have from the first equation i2 equal to 0 so we'll be left over with v1 which is equal to z11 i1 from the first expression and from the second expression this will be 0 so we'll be left with uh, v2 which is equal to z22 i1 so we need to evaluate a we need to have the ratio v1 by v2 so here we have v1 by v2 by v2 all right so this will be v1 by v2 equals z11 z22 and i1 gets cancelled over here all right z i1 uh, in the denominator and uh, numerator gets cancelled and get back to that equation so where is z11 in terms of this one z11 this one all right z11 is equal to what is that y22 by del into z22 z22 is this we have uh, this flips up isn't it z22 is in the denominator so that flips up it's a y11 uh, sorry that this flips up so it's a uh, del upon uh, y11 all right right so something gets cancelled over here del gets cancelled so this ratio is nothing but a which is equal to v1 upon v2 which is equal to z11 by z22 in terms of z parameters and it's a uh, y22 by y11 in y parameters expression for a all right so this is the expression for a and uh, what do we have with this condition what do we have from the second expression 
from the second expression for ABCD parameters, we have, we have, uh, if this is I2 is 0, we have I1 equal to, I1 equal to C times V2 and C will be the ratio I1 by V2, I1 by V2, guys, this is for A, all right, this is for A, this is for A and uh, C is equal to the ratio of I1 by V2 with what condition? I2 equal to 0. Get back to Z parameters. When I2 equal to 0 from the second expression here, from the second expression with I2 equal to 0, we'll be having, uh, what is that? V2 which is equal to Z21 I1. And we are in search of uh, the ratio I1 by V2 to have a, to evaluate C in terms of Z parameters and Y parameters, all right. And here itself we have that one, um, I1 over V2 that will be equal to 1 upon Z21, which is equal to C, all right, C parameter C in terms of Z parameters is uh, 1 upon Z to 1 and go search uh, we already have this expression in terms of Y parameters Z to 1 isn't it Z to 1 this one so 1 upon Z to 1 the reciprocal we have C will be equal to negative del by Y to 1 this is for C C parameter C in terms of Z parameters and in terms of Y parameters all right so this is what we have from uh, making output open making i2 equal to 0 these are the um, conditions we have and from which we have uh, a and c guys i need the place so i'm writing it over here uh, a is done it's a what is that it's a z11 by z22 which is equal to y22 upon y11 and also c is done all right c is done which is equal to 1 upon what is that z21 and so and so so i need this place again uh, to find out uh, what b and d b and d with what condition can it be evaluated making output short circuit which makes v2 equal to 0 all right which makes uh, v2 equal to 0 and that gives us uh, the relationship for c uh, b and d in terms of uh, z and y parameters again all right so with what condition is that with uh, v2 equal to 0 with v2 equal to 0 in the sense output short circuit this time from abcd parameters we have with v2 equal to 0 from the first expression we have uh, v1 equal to b times i mean negative b times i2 so from which b will be equal to negative v1 upon i2 with v2 equal to 0 am i right with v2 equal to 0 we have v1 equal to negative b times i2 so b will be equal to the parameter b will be equal to the ratio of negative times uh, uh, v1 upon i2 all right so we making v2 equal to 0 condition with v2 equal to 0 so the same condition is applied over here right so we don't need z parameters anymore why because uh, i2 is made 0 and we need the, i need this place all right so v2 uh, with v2 equal to 0 from both expressions what do we have let's see if where, the, where, where can we find out that uh, v1 upon i2 i2 is over here all right and v1 is over here so from the second expression with v2 equal to 0 v2 equal to 0 from the second expression we have from this expression if this is 0 we have uh, i2 equal to y21 upon v1 all right and what ratio are we searching for we are searching for that uh, v1 upon i2 which is equal to y21 but b is equal to what will be b b is negative uh, it's sorry it's 1 upon y 2 1 so it will be negative this b negative v1 by i2 so negative 1 upon uh, y 2 1 all right so the same we have that this y parameters in terms of z parameters where that um, negative y 2 1 where do we have this y 2 1 y 2 1 
this negative it's a reciprocal of this one so that flips up del upon negative z21 and negative gets cancelled so this is this is it so it's a b in b in terms of y parameter is this and the same b in terms of z parameter is this all right so this is for the b with the same v2 equal to 0 with the same v2 equal to 0 from the second expression what do we have we have uh, i1 equals negative times d times i2 all right so d will be equal to negative ratio of i1 by i2 right so this will be for b i need the place here with v2 equal to 0 with v2 equal to 0 from the first expression we have uh, i1 equal to y11 v1 with v2 this will be 0 absolutely straight away this will be 0 and from the second expression we have uh, i2 equal to y21 v1 so this ratio i2 by i1 by i2 so this one i1 by i2 i1 by straight away i1 by i2 something gets cancelled over here we don't have this v1 anymore and uh, d will be equal to negative times i1 upon i2 which is equal to negative y11 upon y12 and negative let that negative be as it is y11 where do we have this one this is y11 all right so it's a z22 upon del on the other hand y12 y12 over here what do we have that uh, it's in the denominator so the the reciprocal the uh, flip version of that one so we have that into negative del by z12 right so del gets cancelled so d is equal to the ratio negative i1 upon i2 which is equal to negative y11 by y12 in terms of y parameters and that same uh, d transmission parameter d in terms of z parameter it's a negative gets cancelled all right it's a multiplication over here negative gets cancelled it's so z22 upon z12 so guys we are done uh, previously a c b i erased away and this is d so that's it the four uh, four parameters transmission parameters in terms of uh, this thanks for being with me